There are groups of people out there who say that alien contact must be controlled uh, via the, the governments of this world and that there needs to be a controlled group handling how they conduct themselves. And the reality is these beings uh, aren't going to allow anybody to control them, okay? They're in control of us. They've created us, all of us, all of us, every one of us. And they are the ones that are, are, have been our guardians for a very long time. I want to read something very, very, uh, it's not too long, it's pretty short, but it has to do with the subject. And uh, this is how I responded to many of uh, many of the people. <clears throat> okay, contact or alien contact can't be stopped, and that's the bottom line. As if it could be stopped, it would have already been done by humans. They have no power to do so. Advanced races contacting people of Earth, like myself and others, can't be stopped because they are exactly that, advanced. Advanced races meaning more intelligent than humans, okay? Uh, so, so far, so far, humans have been harmed by these races, and only real harm has happened by a world governments denying the fact that these ETs actually exist. When people who have had contact with these beings speak out about their visits, they get scorned and labeled by these worldly governments because they refuse to admit something exists beyond their control. Now that's just ridiculous. They're out there and they want control of it. These groups want control of these advanced races, how they're going to conduct themselves, but yet they don't want to admit they exist, so they need to make up their mind first of all what it is that they want to happen. Now onward it says, the beings that have created the human race are also protecting the humans from harm from other races which would like to take over this planet and exterminate all humans, every one of them. That means you and anybody else that, that doesn't fit into their little programs, they'll, they'll exterminate them. Okay, if you think... We are uh, all part of the food chain. Yes. Hello everyone. Yeah, this is Mike and Susie. The Susie. Yes. yes, we are all pull, pull, part of this food chain. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, and and I, I can't agree more. But we are to them what exactly what, you, what you're stating. Food, okay? So the bottom line is, if they wanted to kill us and eat us, they can. But anyway, it Absolutely. says, if you, think the, if you think of the ETs protecting humanity from this extinction as angels, then you might feel different about them and actually be thankful they're being the guardians they've always been. And that's what angels ancient scriptures have even said about these beings uh being angels okay they don't call them aliens they, they didn't call them aliens or anything like that they call them angels back in scriptures they didn't know what they were angels That's sent from god yes well the creator you yes. know whatever you want to call it okay mm -hmm. the creator uh, according to scriptures according the to scriptures yes. yes yes and it also refers to god as the creator Oh yes, absolutely. Very often God has to as many, many names. I just prefer that name because God is, a, is sometimes a name people use to to uh, put him in a fictitious character or form. So the Creator is more a bigger subject matter, much I think broader. It's a personal preference. Okay, but I want to what I want to stick to is this train on this, uh, on train of thought on this little video about. Without these guardians, humanity be white, would be wiped out. People want to try to control them, when in reality, if, if they were to go away, all you have is one group of race that wants to kill everybody. And the bottom line is, and that's racism, and that's what people are trying to do. They're calling these races, race, these, these beings racists, because they're saying that they all want to kill everybody. Not all of them want to kill people, okay? This is true. Yes. Okay, they, they not all of them want to do this. Some of them actually want to help humanity and help it evolve. But people have to let, try to let it help it evolve. So by saying that they're all, uh, they want to exterminate and they're all killers and all terrible beings, that's a racist comment. It's like saying all, all one sector of race of humans is, is bad and want to kill everybody. It's the it's most just, racist. It is simply not true. It's one of the most racist comments I've ever heard in my life. And what they want is the government to control some sort of racism here between the public and whatever else. Else and, and control the beings contacting the government can't control itself let alone control these races so the governments don't even have a clue no they don't they have they, they have no idea they're trying to you know between the wealthy and the destitute they're trying to get more and more why while you know what they what they used to call it the 99 percent get nothing 
exactly they do wow. and that's what they've done they've tried to do everything like that very negative that's why i'm not i'm not a real strong opponent or pro, a proponent for the government um i just i'm more of an opponent and i i don't want to say that i don't mean it negatively in any way shape or form i just I, i'm not favor favorable about the whole political structure but that i really don't want to get into that right now because it's okay. kind of we're kind of on a little different topic we, we've had other videos like that i want to i want to kind of stay right here about about this whole thing about them being people humans being racist by saying all the ets are bad okay and that's that's the government's not nonsense. even okay in other, you know, in other words it really is the government's not even existing these beings admitting these beings existence so the reality is what what the problem is isn't the government because they're not even ex not even admitting that these beings exist it's the people saying that they want the government to have control of this contact and, and because they're saying all of these beings are bad and it's the people of this world that are being racist against other races that aren't in this world too so so that's that's my point here in other words racism isn't stuck to this globe okay it isn't stuck right here because they're spreading it out there by having these feelings of not liking certain races out in the cosmos so it's really important for, for people to start looking at their perspectives and start looking at the, the way they act toward advanced races because remember they are advanced and as I stated before I will reiterate again they can wipe us out if they want to all of them why in a they heartbeat, don't yes in a they, heartbeat they, they sure okay could, yes. so humans have a lot of hatred in them towards these races these different races because they're saying they're all the same now I'm gonna close on that you really think about that when you when you go out there and you say that these these beings are all evil and want to control humanity for their own benefits for their own good their own desires that sounds like such a human standard that's looking at the typical I don't know how else to say it bigot or racist Really, it's that simple. Now, really think of that thought there. And racism is not, not good. I, I don't like racism, okay? We're all a melting Me pot. There, it, it, it is so unnecessary. We're all There's a no melting reason. pot. Yes, Every exactly. one of us. Nobody's, nobody's a pure race here. There, there hasn't been pure races since the beginning of ancient hominids, okay? That's the pure race, the hominids. Yeah. Yeah, I don't see any of you walking around with hairy, hairy, uh, big hairy beards and everything all over the place and your arms and everything. I, well, maybe a few, but I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes. There's there is a couple, yeah. Exactly. Anyway, leaving it on that note, just really think about it. Try not to be so racist about all these beings because they're not all bad. Just like not all humans are bad, okay? So have a good night. Good night, everyone.